unfortunate series of events, we are all lucky to have the real talent here at the podium tonight. This is the one and only Katie Quinlan, and I'm Dylan Winspear. Whoa, Dylan, you definitely got that one wrong. I'm not Dylan, you're not Katie? No, the real talent are the performers. We're just the challenged MCs. Speak for yourself. Whatever, Dylan. I hope everyone tonight is ready for the, the talent we're about to see and hear. That's right. These performers have gone through countless numbers of hours practicing, perfecting, and staring death straight in the eye. That sounds pretty intense. Oh, it is. Uh, now, before we get started, there are definitely some people we need to thank for making this night possible. Mom, Dad, thanks for always supporting me in everything I, I choose to pursue. And Pal, Judd, thanks for being here tonight, you know, despite the raffle. I know you guys make, what? We're not doing our things. We thank you for everybody. You know, we need to thank. We need to thank the performers, oh. the backstage crew, the sound booth crew up there, and uh, the student council. Without them, this week would not have gone so smooth, and they made tonight possible. Well, next on our list, we should probably introduce our fabulous judges. That's right. First, we have the best sporty spice in the nation, Miss Soiny. We have the scariest scary spice sense, well, scary spice, Miss Ramish. Next we have B Balding, Mr. Bohacek. Next, the teacher with the best teeth, Mr. Christensen. And the only teacher who knows what they're doing and knows anything about music, Mr. Kapan. Yeah! Well, I think it's about time to get this party started. So, without further ado, here's our first act, Sarah Darsky singing Keeping Our Eyes on the Prize. Give it up. Hold on. Hold on. 
streets up there are paved with gold. Keep your eyes on the prize. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Keep your eyes on the prize. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Feeling, you know all the celebrity couples that combine their names and then everybody like dresses them almost as if they're one person? Mm, yeah, 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 I think I know what you're talking about. Okay, well I know we're not a couple or anything, but what do you think our name would be? Um, how about Dilty Winsland? No, no. Kayline Quinsplan? Uh, what about Kitty and Quinspear? Uh, I don't like either of them. Yeah, I don't really either. But none of them sounds as good as our next act of performers, so here's Jacob Wittenberg and Julian Spindel as Jacob Spindenberg. Jack, Jacob, Jacob Wittenberg. And I'm Julian Spindle. And we're one, two, three. Jacob Jacob Spindenberg. Spindenberg. You may recognize us from the Variety Show and the Taco House. We're going to be playing the song that I wrote called Adrenaline because everyone knows you need your adrenaline on Valentine's Day. <laughs> currently writing a song as he's walking back to the piano.
it's Valentine's Day and you have a girlfriend, right? Yeah, yeah. So what'd you do? Um, nothing. Nothing. And you've been dating how long? A long time. Ooh, okay, well, you're gonna have a lot of making up to do, especially after this act. Yeah, I gotta think of something soon. Uh, here's Jessica Jones and Anthony Vetter singing. Just the part. I got it. Yeah, sure. Well, up next we got Tim Gadman playing synesthesia. Synesthesia. Thank you. 
Dylan, where are you? Okay, you're gonna make fun of what I'm wearing and... What? Okay, what's with the swords? Oh my gosh, all right. So I was reminiscing about the old, old, olden days. You know, in the 90s, right? Oh, okay. And I was, uh, I saw that my all-time favorite show, American Gladiator. All right, I know that show. American Gladiator? Yeah. It was good, it was good. So, as long as we're out here and then, you know, dressed up, you want to do one? <laughs> you know what, I'm in heels now. So what, it'll be a true battle of the sexes. Okay, honestly, I would actually feel bad beating you in front of all these people. Thank you! Try me. Alright, let's go. Dylan, I warned you. You know, next time, leave the dueling up to our next act. Sure. So, next up, we have the dueling harps.
time to redeem all you boys out there of your manhood after that ridiculous duel by Dylan is one of your own. My bad guys. Here's Josh Joswiak singing a song by Nickel Creek. Alright, this, this is a song by Nickel Creek and it's called When You Come Back Down. Happy Valentine's Day, by the way, everyone. And this, this is uh, for my Valentine's Day. Marry me. Dylan, who was your favorite 
90s dancer. The best 90s dancer was definitely MC Hammer. Okay, no way, no way, no way. I'm definitely gonna have to say Vanilla Ice. Are you serious? Yeah. Have you never seen the crisscross? What's the crisscross? Do it. I'll show you. <laughs> Break it down. <laughs> MC Hammer was the best. You know what? I'm gonna end this right here. You know, we're just gonna move on to our next act, who's a, probably a lot better dancer than MC Hammer ever was. All right, all right, fine. So give it up for Strong's crew. Yeah! Sorry, but it's time for intermission. Get up, stretch your legs, and take your potty breaks.
grab a drink, a snack, or something. And if you want to leave the auditorium, make sure you bring your ticket and be back here in your seat in 15 minutes. meeting a little while back talking about the talent show, they mentioned cutting the show short. I know, I know, I know. I quickly reminded them that we needed more than a half hour show. We had more talent than Creed in St. Thomas. We actually wanted to like extend it to a three day event, kind of like Wee Fest or... Or like Rosie O'Donnell getting out of bed. <laughs> well, all we can do is get a second half, so let's get it started. First off, we have Andrew Warner with an original song. Give it up. Take my hand, 
try not to cry Just one last walk Don't say our goodbyes Since I'm beginning And I just am So remember us Please are
How about baseball and sunflower seeds? Oh, that's really good. Yeah. Okay. What about, what about gray hair and Mr. Fox? Ooh. Or better, how about no hair and Mr. Bahacek? This ne next hand is a really original pair that goes great together. Give it up for Anna, not Anna, and James. This song, um, I wrote it, and James really helped me out with uh, accompanying me, and the song is called Let It Go. I wrote this for a friend. Daisy, you know what I'm talking about.
This next act is a great one. Who is it? This kid is a promising star. We all know this kid's name. Oh, I know who you're talking about. Yeah, this kid's been at Sibley, a star at Sibley, for the last three years. And I'm sure he'll do great things to come in the future. Okay, so are we talking about Phil or Andre? <laughs> no, who are they? <laughs> I'm talking about Jacob Winberg. Here he is with an original composition. I love you both, baby.
All right, before this next act, I got some more funny jokes. What? What do you call a person who hangs out with musicians? I don't know. A drummer. I once asked a drummer how to spell Mississippi. What did he say? He said the river or the state. Oh. Uh. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. What do you call a beautiful woman on a drummer's arm? Uh. A tattoo. Uh. <laughs> all right. Well, enough ripping on drummers, and let's let our next act prove us all wrong. Here's a drum solo by Cole Jessen. Yeah!